I believe was to him. Right, we come now to the final of the under 100 kilo category. Ilya Sulemanidze of Georgia goes up against Patkuyag Konchik Suren of Mongolia. It'll be Sulemanidze in the white jadogi. Patkuyag in blue. Let's have a look at the route to the final. Bricheno, Bezdek and Buzikarini were down by Sulemanidze and it was uh, Saduakas, Berla, Kontalvis and Elnahas who were downed by Batuyag on his way to the final. The referee in the middle for this one is Katharina Marzog of Germany. Solomonidze, for me, definitely uh, the man of uh, the day uh, for, for me. I just think he's uh, shown absolute class. He's uh, gone through uh, his opponents just one after another. In and, style. Uh, yeah, in real style and uh, very cool, calm, collected. He's going to have to be a little bit cautious here with um, uh, uh, Bat uh, Hugyak uh, of uh, Mongolia because uh, although we, uh, we don't know too much about him, I mean, he is world ranked 26, but he's had a good day. And uh, through El Nahas in the uh, semi final with a beauty. And uh, so he just cannot uh, hang about here, and I don't think he's going to. Solomon Idzi in white here. Batkuyag may be inspired by yesterday's performance from Batsaya in the final. He was terrific, the young Mongolian. Yeah, big strong grip there over the top there. Batsuyag blocks that fairly easily. the way he just attacks off that grip. Sometimes he hasn't got two hands on. Yeah, half, half an attempt and half bailing out. We'll go with the attempt this time round. Crowd really up for this, of course they are. That's why they're here. So he's got to be careful of that right arm there. It's got to go in, and that was an Osoda Gary there. And again, like I say, I love the way that he attacks when he hasn't got both hands on. There's yeah. the Oruki Gary, and he gets the Ipon, does he? No, it's Wazari called. Two different landings with it. All right, so he'll go, oh, he goes onto his backside, then onto his back. Watch this. He'll go down, and then onto his back. That's why it's a Wazari. Great call from the referee there, very, very good. And uh, Osana Gary! Oh, brilliant stuff here. Solomon Idzi is not disappointing. The crowd are here to see it. Yeah, the Mongolians were up there uh, in the crowd there. They're cheering as well. I think it uh, is not for Solomon. <laughs> I think it's for their man. Better grip here. Oh, now he's then. gone over. Has he got it back? Yeah. Yes, so. yes. Yep. He gets the Wazari back there, and uh, I said that he's going to have to go in hard. He will have to go in hard. Now then, he's got the hold down. Oh, just manages to turn out that hold down. And it was almost a disaster there for Solomon Idze. Wow, brilliant stuff. Credit there. Well, they, they've waved it off, uh, the Wazari Blue. Well, they've had a chance to, to see it for a second time and probably from two or three different angles. We just saw it the once. So Batuyag has got to do it again, but uh, it was a, a poor technique from Salomon Idze and uh, gets taken backwards. I think it was because it was in several pieces that uh, he didn't, it wasn't smooth enough, so uh, didn't get the score on it. <coughs> yeah. 
There's the uh, attack, and uh, now he's on top of him. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. So uh, we can see now different yeah. angle there. You can see why uh, it wasn't smooth enough, and uh, the initial first landing wasn't. He enough. lands on his body. Yeah, he did. Yeah. He landed on his body. Uh, there Not was on the uh, space between yeah. them. You've got to put your opponent on the mat. <laughs> I still think he's going to go for the other Wazari, uh, Suleiman Idzi. Same here. Not going to sit back. Well, that wasn't the best effort from Batuyag. Batuyag, though, is going to come forward. He's going to pile the pressure on. He looks really strong, doesn't he? Suleiman Idzi must know that... Batuyag's going to come for him because he's a Wazari down. He's got to come at him. Yeah. And if we, if he, if we know the kind of player that Suleiman is, he's going to be waiting for it. He, he is going to be waiting, uh, and I, I just think it's going to be a massive attack, and it'll be uh, not necessarily when he's got two hands on. I think actually the uh, the difficulty is when he's got two hands on. Well, that so was Batyag. Poor from Batyag because he had he had the opportunity with Sulemanidze uh, being overly defensive. Why would you hold on to one side? Maybe yeah. that's why Sulemanidze was being overly defensive. He was being put under pressure with that unorthodox grip, but held for too long by Batyag, and he picked up Ashido. Yeah. Gone into defensive mode yeah. now, hasn't he? There, Sulemanidze. Well, penalty free. Not going to lose it now. Only chance for. Shido now for sure. Only one chance for Batuyag here. He's got to throw Sulemanidze. David Kevkishvili keeping himself out of the action. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Up in the stands there. Big cross grip there. That'll do now. Yeah, that will do. Absolutely, that will do. Three seconds left on the clock. Looks almost set, doesn't it? Uh, medal, gold medal number two here for Georgia. He knows it's gone. Good performance, Solomon Edze. That was a really good performance, and uh, well, you credit to uh, the uh, Mongolian there, but uh, Batyag was really, really strong. He was strong. Everybody on their feet here. Well, if there was a big chair for Lasha, for Kauri, there was a bigger chair for Ilya Sulemanidze. I wonder what will happen if Gelas Alashvili does it in the plus. <laughs> <laughs> that bring the house down. I think so. I think it's going to bring the house down anyway. I really do. Driving Ochi Gary there, scores. Takes him uh, onto his backside first. If it had been a bit smoother, it would have uh, warranted the Ippon. But it went in two parts. Hits with the backside, then he pushes him onto his back there. So it's two different parts. Good was Ari. Wow, they celebrate up in the crowd. Absolutely, they love it. They're going to be back for the uh, final match, that's for sure, because I think it's going to end uh, with a, a Georgian possibility as well. It's as though they had written this script and said, right, we're going to get them warmed up and we're going to... Let's get them warmed yeah, up. Make, let's uh, make lose them a feel few. as though it's... Yeah, yeah let's make let's it look away as if we're going to end up with nothing. <laughs> And then let's see if we can pull Top three the table. back. <laughs> Just to win it.